COL family. Good morning, COL family. It is indeed a pleasure to be in the house of the Lord one more time. I want to give honor to my chief, to the Lord who is the head of my life. Second, I want to give honor and due to my chief apostle, my elect lady, and all other ministers in their prospective places. At this time, we will have a prayer by Mother Latricia Covert. Hallelujah, Lord God. Hallelujah, Lord God. Hallelujah, Lord God. Bread of heaven, thank you, Lord. Bread of heaven, thank you, Lord. Bread of heaven, thank you, Lord. But this is the day. This is the day, Lord, that you have made. You have made for the mothers of the world all over this land and country. We come celebrating, Lord God. Because truly you have been good. You've been better to us than we've been to ourselves. And we come saying, thank you, Lord, on this great Mother's Day. Thank you, Lord. You may be a biological mother. We thank you. You may be a mother of season. We thank you. You may be a mother that's filling in the gap. We thank you. Wherever you are, Lord God, we want you to know that we are truly thankful this day. God, you've done so much for us. There was a songwriter that said, with the spring, summer, and fall, all you got to do is just call me. Call me, Lord. Call me. And I will stand in the gap. Lord God, there were plenty of times when mothers went to the cupboard and there was nothing there. Jesus, Jesus. There were plenty of times when the doctors and the mothers went to the doctors and with bad news, but they came out and they persevered. Jesus, Jesus, we come thanking you, Lord. Thanking you, Lord. You are our word. You are a word that feeds us every day. Lord God, you watch over us as we slumber and we sleep. Lord God, you're better to us than we're better than we are to ourselves. Lord God, we come thanking you today. Thanking you, Lord. God, we know that even though your mother may not be here, but God, I thank you that we serve a God that said I go off and prepare a place so I may meet you again. But Lord, now your story lives within my spirit. And I come saying, thank you, Lord. Thank you for that spiritual love. Thank you for that spiritual understanding. Thank you, Lord, for filling that void. Thank you, Lord, for being mercy. Thank you, Lord. Just thank you, Lord. Because truly you're worthy to be praised. Lord God, we as we leave this place, we want to look at our apostle who preached to us every day from his heart. Thank you for elect lady who is a encouraging person. We thank her for being in our lives as well. Members of this great church, mothers all over this world, we want you to hear our cry today, Lord God. Because truly you are have you have blessed. You have been blessed, Lord God. You have been blessed by the God that look high and sit low, Lord God. And we just want to thank you. Lord God, bite your pride today. Embrace your mothers. Lord God, if they're here with you, embrace them, Lord God. Because truly they are worthy. Heavenly Father, you look around and we see our children forgetting about their mothers forgetting about their fathers. But today, Lord God, we want to lift our mothers up. Lord God, we want them to be a part of our lives. Enjoy them while you can. The world is not waiting on you. You got to do it while you can. Heavenly Father, just thank you. We thank you, Lord God, for our mothers. I hope that you are there today. I hope you leave this place differently than you came in. Lord God, we just thank you for what you're going to do. We thank you for being in the gap. These things we ask in the mighty name of Jesus, we pray. Amen. Somebody ought to tell God thank you. Somebody ought to tell God thank you. I do not see the person that we have on program from our scripture. So can I get...
thinking that's Nevi Hogan? Tasha, can you come get me? As Nevi come, would you please give her a hand? But now does said the Lord that created thee, O Jacob, that he had formed thee. O Israel, fear not, for I have redeemed thee. I have called thee by thy name, thou art mine. When thou passest through the waters, I will be with thee. Through the rivers, they shall not overflow thee. When thou walkest through the fire, thou shalt not be burned, neither shall the flame kindle up on thee. Thank God for the word. Thank you, Nevi, for that scripture. Now we will have Judah time. Come on, praise the Lord, everybody. Come on, praise the Lord. When I rose this morning, I was praying. I know.
going to rise in of the sun to the going down of the same. Hey, what? Hey, what? How many of know you know I would have made it? I can speak for myself. I know I would have made it. If it had not been for the Lord that was on my side. Yeah. Yeah. He's God, I tell you. He's God, I tell you. Oh, taste and see that the Lord, He is good. Ma, 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 ma. Thank you, God. Thank you, God. He won. You ought to tell God, thank you. You ought to tell God, thank you. Woo, He's a keeper. He's a keeper. He's a keeper. He'll keep you if you want to be kept. He's a keeper. How bad do you want it? How bad do you want it? How bad do you want to be kept by the Lord? Thank you, God. Thank you. Thank you, God. Thank you, God. Woo, my, 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 my. Thank you, God. Now we'll have our welcome by Prophetess Latasha Pierre.
Hallelujah. First, give that to God who's ahead of my life to our chief apostle, to our late lady. What an awesome time we are having so far. And we have any first time business, we actually do please stand so we can acknowledge your presence here. Any first time business on today, we actually please stand. Any visitors, please stand. Well, we are here. And we are COF. We know what to do. Holy Spirit, have your way. You are already welcome. Happy Mother's Day to all the mothers. Once again, you are welcome, welcome, welcome. Thank Prophet Tasha for that warm welcome. Now we will have our anointed announcement, uh, announcements by Gatekeeper Stanley. Good morning, church family. First, come on to God, who's the head of my life. To an awesome God that we serve. To his great chief apostle. To the late lady. To the entire church family. These are our announcements. These are our announcements. When the men are in place, the order of God is defined. Every third Sunday, let's see the grace of God upon our men. Bring it by ages 16 to 30 until we have 50 men here at one time. Please continue to be loyal and faithful to our Tuesday night Bible encounter here in person or via Facebook Live. The School of the Prophets is in session. Class will begin at 8.15 a.m. This class is open to all members. Cathedral of Faith, the place where we maximize our love, the ministry of help is expanding with grace. The caretaker's ministry, serving the apostle, and doorkeeper ministry are expanding with you in mind. Please see Prophetess Leah Sutton or Sister Katrina High today about joining our team. Attention parents, this is the time of the year where we celebrate our accomplishments and our new chapter journey for our youth. Congratulations to the class of 2022. If your children will be graduating, head start preschool, kindergarten, elementary, middle school, or high school, or college, please stop by the youth office to sign their name on our list. Third Sunday dinner will be sold here at the temple in the MLR Fellowship Hall. The menu for this month is beef chips, green beans, rice, and rolls. Price are as follows, adults $7, children $5. Let's watch the team work to make the dream work. Sunday, May the 29th, 2022, at 11 a.m., there will be a new members orientation brunch and class held in the main sanctuary. All pastors are to be present for the introduction of the new members, maximizing our love unapologetically. Chief Apostle's calendar. When traveling, Chief Apostle needs two armor bearers, two caretakers, and all pastors. Let's keep in mind that our pastor needs our support when traveling. So let's strengthen our leader and support. Sunday, May the 22nd, 2022, Pleasant Grove Missionary Baptist Church, 40th Pastoral Anniversary. Reverend, Reverend Rufus Watley, 82 Morrow in Maker, Georgia. The time is 12 noon. Sunday, May the 22nd, 2022, Mount Carey Baptist Church, Pastor Quentin Taylor. 2704 Antioch Road in Macon, Georgia. The time is 2 p.m. Let's continue to be safe, wear a mask, and sanitize your hands. The church is moving in love and with safety. This concludes our announcements. Bear all announcements in mind. Let's keep our leaders lift up in prayer. Chief Apostle Bertice Rosia and elect lady. Thank you. Come on, our clap could be better than that, church. We want to thank Gatekeeper Stanley for that warm announcement. Now we will have a solo by Sister Michaela Pierre. Makaya, I'm sorry. Pierre. Let's give her a hand if she come, please. Hallelujah. First, give not to God who's dead in my life. To our chief apostle, to our late lady, and to all the mothers, happy Mother's Day. 
The Lord bless you and keep you. May his face shine upon you. Be gracious to you. The Lord turn his face for you and give you peace. Lord bless you and keep you. May his face shine upon you. Be gracious to you. Lord turn his face towards you and give you peace.
up Pastor Diane Heaven. Come on and give God some praise this morning. Come on and give God some praise this morning. Hallelujah. Woo, my, my. We do give honor to God who's the head of our life. To the angel of this house. His grace. Chief Apostle Bertice Rosier. If everyone will stand all over this arena. And put your sanctified hands together. With a loud shout. Let's thank God. For Chief Apostle Bertice Rosier. Come on, praise the Lord, everybody. Come on. Come on, praise the Lord. Have your seats in the presence of the Lord. Amen. We do want to honor the mother um, over this ministry. The mother, amen, elect lady, Linda Elaine. Come on, spiritual mother. Come on, y'all celebrate her. I think she deserves it. Come on. Come on. She's our spiritual mother here. Hallelujah. That's the E-legged lady, e -leg. Rosia. And all God's people said amen. If it had not been for the Lord who was on our side. My Lord, tell your neighbor, you don't have to preach to him and say, if it had not been for the Lord on my side. The Lord. I'm talking about the Lord. I... wonderful God. Amen. The mother of our church is on vacation. Her sons have a amen. That's all right. Amen. When you can. Listen, I'm so grateful. Amen. Um, she was the one of the first members 28 years ago and she's here with us, Sister Darcina. Stand up, Sister Darcina. Come on, y'all give her a hand. Come on. We love you. We love you. Amen. God bless you. Amen. I don't care where she goes. Amen. She's going to talk about this ministry. Amen. We thank God for Mama Jean. Amen. Um, she's the one that calls me every morning on the radio and to tell Sister Jack and her daughter business. Amen. Stand up, Mother Jean. Come on. She's joining with us this morning. Y'all clap here. Evangelist Hawthorne's mother. Amen. Mother, we're so glad um, to have you here. I want to say thank you happy mother's day to you all amen my daughter is here we want to say happy mother's day to her stand up amen hallelujah amen she looking dressed up saved today just up saved amen my sister would you all stand amen thank you happy mother's day amen to you all god bless you to all the mothers that that is a mother will you stand will you stand all the mothers Come on, all the mothers. Come on, we can do better than that. Look at this. Come on, God bless you all. Amen. Happy Mother's Day. Amen. Have your seat. Amen. Kayasta stood up. We'll talk about that after church. Amen. We're going to have a special meeting. Amen. Amen. So we say Happy Mother's Day. And uh, we certainly have something for all of our mothers this morning uh, amen, and all of our churches. Amen. We, we are grateful um, for such a powerful worship service amen, on this morning. Amen. It's always good. Um, I was praying and I told God, thank you for, I, I don't thank you for my house. I'm grateful for all of that and my cars and all that stuff. But that stuff can go. Amen. I am so grateful that God included me in the kingdom. I'm grateful for the gift he's given me. Watch this, the gift of faith. I got the gift of faith. Come on now. I got the gift of faith so that whatever I pray, that's the confidence. <laughs> that's the confidence that I... <laughs> Lord, help me here. Tell your neighbor, whatever I pray, it's going to show up. My, that's why people call you and say, pray for me. Because they know if you pray, it's 
is going to show up. Touch your neighbor next to you if I pray is going to show up. Yeah, I may laugh, I may joke, I may play, but oh! if I pray, if I have to go to Savannah and see the ship coming in, I know it will show up. Tell your neighbor I got the gift of faith. It's going to show up now. You better not tell, you better not tell me to pray. Cause Watch out, Pastor Walker. It's going to show up. When I get through praying, I know it's already done. I don't even pray a second time. I know when I heard me the first time. So from that point, all I'm saying is say to the Lord, rebuke you. Because the Lord heard me. You trying to hold my stuff up. He told Daniel, I heard you the first time. Now you know your stuff is held up. I need you to say, say to the Lord, rebuke you. Loose my stuff. My job go. You let my money go. You let my promote loose. Anybody know it's released right now? I go with where the Lord tell me. Say it's released right now. Yes, it is. out of your family that we're going to have a happy week. Ain't nobody going to be stressed this week. Ain't nothing going to happen to make us cry. Ain't nobody suiciding this week. Ain't nobody depressed this week. Y'all in the right church? Y'all in the right church? Y'all in the right church. Look at them again and say, I prayed. I know you're going to have a happy week. I know. That's the covenant I prayed. I'm, you get ready for Monday, good news. I... Watch out in the back. I see angels back there behind you. I see the angels of the Lord. Somebody spread your hands out and say, get ready for the overflow. He said he had desired above all that my soul. He desired above all that I prosper and be in good health, even at my soul. Church don't like this, but I want you to tell eight people, be well. Be wealthy, be wealthy, be live rich, live, have more than enough. Check your account. Woo! Go to the mailbox. Demand human resources to give me my promotion. Command human resources to give me my raise. I'm in the right church. Alright, I got all right, see ya. The angel of encouragement is in here. I know y'all don't like that angel, but the angel of encouragement, the angel. All right. Y'all believe that Quanidria? What if you believe it? Let me say, yeah, yeah, yeah. We're getting ready to go down the dam, but before I go, I'm going to tell you this. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Three people be sad no more.
here. We got to get out of here, but tell them. I 
I wrote the last part. Let's get a prayer. <laughs> now the new rain. It's a new season. It's a new day. It's a new rain. All right, we got to be out of here in 15, 20 minutes. Have your seat. Mother Hayes is coming in a few minutes. Amen. It's offering time. Come on, Camry. Amen. Come on, Camry. Come on, D. Come on, you come on too. Amen. You ain't got to get mad. Amen. You like that much, y'all. We got you, Demario. Chill out. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. We are a happy church. And we maximize our love here. Amen. I need you to come on, come on. Elder, you all right? Amen. Y'all give him another piece of gum. He don't want that one out the whole service. Yeah, that. <laughs> he don't want that one out. It's going to get him another piece of gum. Amen. We're going to keep <laughs> Drop the other one on the floor. So. I'll be watching, don't I? Bro, y'all, Pastor, y'all got enough piece of gum because he don't want this one out. <laughs> All right. Y'all should have told me y'all was wearing yellow. All right. Um, let's do this. Amen. <laughs> I need you to help me out this morning. This is such a wonderful church. Amen. Nisi, Nisi, stand, Nisi. Amen. Amen. This is Nisa's new friend, so y'all don't know not to be looking at him. He did, he did your hand wave. He did that. <laughs> y'all from the same area. <laughs> Amen. <laughs> we got you. We won't, they won't be looking at him. Amen. <laughs> you, know, <laughs> you, you know when there's somebody new, because she usually shot long. You know, you usually can't break her out of her shot. You know, we have to almost get her up. But ever since she brought him, she only shout for 30 seconds. Okay, who look at that? I'm back. Okay? Holy Spirit, don't do it alone. <laughs> Get in the car. The next time I shout, you better hold your head down and close your eyes. Until I come through. Amen. Amen. <laughs> All right, God bless you, church. God bless you. I, I need you to help me this morning. Happy Mother's Day. And it's good to see all of you. And I know it is it's bittersweet in a lot of areas this morning. Amen. So we're, we're going to respect every area. Every area. Amen. I need 50 people. How many? 50 people to stand with me. And it is here with a $100 seed. I'm one. That's right. Two. Come on. I want you to move real quick. Those 50 people. Those 50 people move real quick. Whether it's cash app, whether it's on, I still need you to move. Bring me the oil. I have to do something. Amen. Bring me the oil. Come on, 50 people. 50 people. Come on, 50 people. 50 people. Hallelujah. 50 people. Hallelujah. Come on, Pastor. Y'all move. Amen. We're going to move. We're going to move the credit card machine in the line with the people. Amen. 50 people. 50 people. 50 people. 50 people. Come on, we're going to move them in the line. We're going to move them in the line. There's 50 people. The Lord said so. Amen. And I'm not going to change what the Lord said. Amen. When the Lord bless you, amen. And the way you keep blessing is you tithe on what God gave. Come on, y'all talk to me, church. You tithe on it. You let God know I appreciate what you've done for me. Amen. If not, you're going to keep going through the same cycle over and over. I need those 50 people to move in this house. I need those 50 people to move in this house. Come on, that's 50 people. Come on, that's 50 people. Stay in the line. That's something the Lord told me to do. Something the Lord told me to do. I will lift up your name. I will lift up your name.
right there. Wait a minute, I said everybody. I'm waiting on everybody. Tell your neighbor here, show up. Amen. Thank you, deacons. Thank you. Everybody standing. Amen. Let's receive the regional mother of this organization. Clap your hand for regional mother. Hey! First, I would like to give them unto God, the head of my life, to the greatest chief apostle on this side of heaven, to our 
select lady to everyone in respective places. First, I'd like to say, let the words of my mouth, the meditation of my heart, be acceptable in my sight. Oh Lord, my strength and my redeemer. Amen. At this time, I will be reading from the NLT Bible. And I would like to give you my topic before I read. My topic on today, well, I had one topic, and then the Lord had me to change my topic. So now my topic is, what issue are you carrying? Now I'll be reading Saint, I mean, I'll be reading Mark, the fifth chapter and the 25th verse, all the way to the 31st, 34th verse. Now a woman in the crowd had suffered for, t for 12 years with a certain, with, with cons consistent bleeding. She had suffered a great deal from many doctors. And over the years, she had spent everything that she had to pay them. But she had gotten no better. In fact, she got worse. She had heard about Jesus. So she came up behind him through the crowd and touched his robe. For she thought to herself, if I can just touch his robe, I will be made whole. Immediately, the blood stopped. And she could feel in her body that she had been healed of her ter terrible condition. Now Jesus realized at once the healing, the healing power had gone out of him. So he turned around to the crowd and asked, who touched my robe? The disciples said to him, look around this crowd, pressing against you. How can you ask who touched me? But he kept looking around to see who had done it. Then the frightened, the frightened woman, trembling at the realization of what she had, what she had, what happened to her, and she and she and she fell to her knees in front of him and told him what she had done. And he said to her, Daughter, your faith has made you well. Go in peace. Your suffering is over. Now, I was trying to figure out what did, she, how did she get this way? How? How could this happen to her? So, I looked up in Google, and Google states that a bleeding disorder can be the results of another disease or a lack of vitamin K. It can also be inherited from another family member. Now, this woman was in, this woman was in, this woman, even though she was, even though she was not supposed to be in the midst of the crowd, she was in the midst of the crowd. Now, in Leviticus, it tells you, chapter 15, it will tell you, verse 25, that she was unclean. So I want everybody to know, to remember that this lady is unclean. Now she has blended herself inside the crowd. She suffered, suffered greatly over the years. Her issue became a part of her lifestyle for 12 years, repeatedly being in pain. This woman 
I do believe that she had faith. She had to have faith to go through this pain for this long. Turn to your neighbor and say, hold on to your faith. Now, at this point, this woman has spent all she had. All she had. Everything she had in her house, she gave it away. When she ran out of money, she had other choices, so she spent all she had. So I can say maybe her house is empty now because she gave everything away. Okay. Now she went from doctor to doctor trying to get healed. But she got worse. Matter of fact, things got critical. Critical. Now it can't get no worse than that. It got critical. Now she spent all her money. She went to the doctors. The doctors gave her the wrong antidote. The wrong antidote, guys. The doctor gave her the wrong antidote. Okay. Now, let's go back to the crowd. She's in the crowd trying to get to Jesus. Even the crowd know that she was unclean. But she paid the crowd no mind. She was trying to get to Jesus. She was trying to press her way to Jesus. She was trying to press her way, guys, to Jesus. You know what? We all have issues. You want to believe it or not? We have issues. All types of issues. Little issues, big issues. But we have to do what she does. Hold on to your faith. Hold on to your faith. In the midnight hour, hold on to your faith. You're not feeling good. Hold on to your faith. You don't have no friends because they're talking about you. They changed your name to the unclean woman. Pay that no mind. Hold on to your faith. In the midnight hour, God will give you strength. In the midnight hour, God will give you strength. He may not come when you want him, but he'll be there right on time.
can talk about my issue. I don't know about your issue. Sometimes issues come every day. Every day you can have an issue. But you know what? You have to know what to do with the issue. Don't let your issue leech on you. Don't let your issue leech on you. Don't let it get added. Don't let it add to another issue. Then another issue. Then another issue. It will wear you down. Don't let your issue wear you down. So I want to leave with you on today. Please, before you leave here, come to the altar and leave the issue behind. Come on, give the Lord praise, everybody. Come on, let's give our regional mother, everybody standing. Father, we thank you for the regional mother. Touch her now. Thank you, Lord, for the word of God that our issue will not weigh us down. So we're going to touch you on purpose. And Father, we thank you and we praise you in Jesus' name. Give God the best praise you can. Remain standing for 30 seconds. Peaches, if you would come here, please. Real quick, real quick. Sandra, come here. Sister Dot, I'm going to ask you to do me. Give me the oil, sweetheart. I'm going to ask you just to do me a favor. You go back to your seat and sit down. Sister, Sister Darcina. If you can just anoint her hand and her head for me. Where's Jamal? John Darcy and us the power of the Lord is real Messiah. Right. Take that oil with you. Come in there.
Each one of you hug your mother and say, we're going to live. We're going to live and not die. One by one. We break the curse. We break the curse. That's her. Love her. Love her. So what the devil tried to put between us, it won't work. We love you, mama. an angel I'm telling you I'm telling you man I'm telling you somebody tell her and her family live now live 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 in peace 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 yes I God heard it God heard it. Go ahead, come on. We got to get out of here. We got to go to Danville. I don't know who you are, but come here, young lady with the black dress on. Come here. Right here. Yes, you. On the way up here, I want you to say my storm is passing over. And my hell is over. My hell is over. You've been through hell for the last two or three weeks that you felt like you were going to break. But it's over right now. You can praise it. You can quit crying about it. Go ahead. Pre ah! said help me dance to my next destiny that's a promotion that's another plea that i'm getting ready to go another level over us. Tell your neighbor his new ring. That's what it is. 
because his new reign <laughs> is washing away old things. It's cleaning up my mind. It's cleaning up my heart. I know what it is. Somebody look at him and say, new reign. I know what it is. I've been waiting on it. Pastor, your love offering time. Come on. Come on, Pastor Hammond. Let me do this print. Give me that from behind you. Mother Hayes, will you come? We would like to present you with this. It's such an awesome job. God bless you. Happy Mother's Day. And God bless you. It's my offer time. Let's give Mother Hayes. It's beautiful on her. Pastor Hammer, let the Lord minister to you. Don't let the Lord minister. Praise the Lord, everybody. We thank the Lord what He has done so far. Truly, He's in this place. Hallelujah, hallelujah. We have been blessed on this morning. Amen. I don't know about you, but I don't know what you was feeling when you came in. But you didn't. You will not leave the same way you came. Amen. Amen. Truly, we have been blessed. We just thank God for the angel of this house. An awesome vessel of God. Whew. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. It is time for us to be a blessing too the man of God on this morning. Amen. 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 It is pastor love offering time in the house. This is a time as a collective body that we all join together to be a blessing to the man of God. Amen. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. Glory. Hallelujah. Glory. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. This is still ministry. Amen. The service is not over yet. Hallelujah. Giving is ministry. Amen. 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 Hallelujah. 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 Glory. Hallelujah. I don't know. It's just a strong pull to be a blessing to the man of God. Hallelujah. That there is a strong pull to be a blessing to the men of God. Amen. Hallelujah. Let the Holy Spirit lead you. Let the Holy Spirit minister to you of what to do for the men of God. Amen. Amen. From all over this arena, if you will come to be a blessing to the man of God. Hallelujah.
Hallelujah. the mothers would remain in the sanctuary once we are done. If all the mothers would remain in the sanctuary. Hallelujah. Have everyone had a chance to plan? Don't miss this opportunity. Don't miss this opportunity. There is no gimmick in giving. There, there is no way that you can give and just because you gave, hallelujah, it's no gimmick, amen, into planning in the man of God, amen. At this. Every mother, will you Every mother, go ahead. Amen. 